my dear friends today i am providing some important uh, that means common doubts in tally that is first one is how to learn tally at home one of my friend asking he is having computer he has studied bcom he want to learn tally at home for this those who are uh, willing to learn tally at home we will send uh, this uh, tally educational mode software plus videos see videos we have what are the videos we have is this is tally videos we have so many videos so the entire thing we will send through cd tally software also we will send just download and go through this uh, video say example how to enter payment and reset this is payment and reset entry see this is the video then afterwards how to create a company this is the first step see like that we have up to 20 videos so you can go through that here also some videos and, impo and important videos so you can learn easily at your home tally software i will send you installation file that is a example like this file installation file just you have to uh, install this software in your computer after that go to tally this is after installation you can find this icon click this see this is the educational mode that means there is no serial number so go here how to run educational mode see second question is how to work tally in educational mode this is the educational mode work in educational mode enter say silver version say select company and go ahead now the second question is third question is how to carry forward ledger names and opening balances and tally this very important question because people are working up to that is April to March after that uh, they will not able to continue from April next year April onwards uh, because they have problem is the period is uh, 1 to 1 4 April to 31st March so they need to create new directory when you create new directory you have to feed uh, all the ledger names and carry forward opening balances see this exercise it is very difficult to do manually so there is one option called uh, data split once you do this process it is very e easy to carry forward ledger names and opening balances how to do this is I will explain see here my data is 14 13 to 31 3 13 say and you want to carry forward this uh, next 14 to 15 say click here period then 31 3 15 after that say here 13 to 15 then go to company info then split the data select a company say select enter 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 that's all keep on enter 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 okay that is the thing so at present I don't want to split my data okay this is the process and now the fourth question is how to carry forward account names forward account names account names only see because sometimes accounts may not um, finalized so that you have to transfer only account names to next year it is very rare rare situations 
so what to do is you go to tally and display statistics statement of accounts statistics ledgers go to ledgers then export here say here you have to choose XML data so here location where to save the file say tell your p9 directory file name is master.xml that's it okay after that you create one new directory that is create new directory say anything 1415 after that what you have to do is go to import of data say this is the new directory import of data masters file c colon tally dot erp 9 slash master dot xml see the file name is master dot xml the location is c colon tally erp 9 masters that's it Ignore duplicates, modify with new data. File not found. So I have to search whether the file name is correct or not. Go here. G colon, sorry. That is the thing. This is the thing. The tally is not in C. That is the thing. G colon. That's it. Now see the ledgers will be, will appear. Display accounts ledgers. The basic salary discount everything has come. Okay. Next thing is how to send tally data through email so go to tally folder account books say here tally erp9 data see say example I want to send email to this company add to zip that's all this is I can attach to email and send. So one zero double three. One zero double three is one zero double three. This is this company data will go can be sent through email. Then next thing what are the useful shortcut keys in tally? This is very important question. Say example in this company. Shortcut keys. Say example trial balance. Say go here. So I want to see this group. What are the what is the group? So press control enter direct expense. I want to change this ledger name keep the cursor here control enter say example state bank account that's it this is control enter key the use of control key is when you are in trial balance you can edit the ledger information say control enter 
and you can able to alter and I'll tell you one more uh, shortcut key is Alt 2 that is for copy key. Say I want to copy this invoice. Keep the cursor here and Alt 2, Alt plus 2. That's it. Say one more voucher has been copied. How to delete the voucher? How to delete the voucher? Here is select this, select this then clear uh, click here d or alt d then afterwards alt or how to rewrite the data i will tell you but sometimes if any error comes that uh, how to rewrite the data i will tell you later now narration how to enter narration automatic in the previous voucher say example display statement of accounts otherwise daybook sorry display statement of accounts statistics Payments. Where is the payments? Here, payments. Sangita Mobile. See, this is Sangita Mobile. Sangita Mobile. Say, I am going to enter narration. Paid. Check to Sangita Mobiles. See, this narration has come to automatically for next payment voucher. So after that, how to, from here onwards you can enter payment, that is called Alt A, press Alt A, say Sangeeta Mobiles, 2000, here press Control R, that's it. And then useful shortcut keys over. Now, how to set voucher numbers as manual and automatic? See, it is very simple. Go to account info, voucher types, alter, sales. Here automatic. You can change it as manual. That is saying no problem. After this, you save it. That's it. Yes. E. How to solve memory access violation error in tiling? Me some uh, the problem will uh, very rare. If it comes this problem, what to do is go to rewrite the data. To rewrite the data is close all the companies, set company, set company. Now here press Control Alt R, Control Alt R, then select the company. Rewrite yes, that's it. That's over. So your problem will be clear. If not uh, able to rewrite, there may be some mistake. That is, some files has to delete and rewrite. If any problem comes, you contact us. Send that folder by uh, through RAR file. That is zip file through email. We will uh, retrieve your data. How to take backup and restore? See backup is very simple. Backup. Say example destination. Wherever you can. Here source means tally. Where is the tally? G colon tally airplane data. That is the source. 
destination you can store anywhere say example d drive like that say example i want to store this would not complete what happened d colon say example rajkumar that's it now restore data is go to restore destination this is d colon this is see when you enter d colon the company will come just enter enter that's it that's enough before restoring please mind this 101012 directory should not be in your uh, tally folder because one city is having this folder that previous da data will rewrite please take care and how to link delivery chalan with sales invoice this is already we have the video in youtube go to youtube.com and search for uh, gadam in youtube so you will find a ledger that is how to make delivery chalan how to make purchase order how to receive sales order and purchase order you can go through that these two questions is over how to clear further doubts if you have any further doubts you can contact contact me at 91 plus 9543198132 this is you can also contact in whatsapp this is my whatsapp id 91 plus 91 is the near country code 9543198132 sorry 198132 this is the number once you contact we will send solution over phone see one or two doubts i can solve through whatsapp if your doubts is lengthy we can uh, prepare video for your requirement so it will charge around 500 rupees thank you for watching my video